Thank you all for coming today. I really appreciate it. And thank you for participating in our school climate survey. I really appreciate all the hard work on this. Our school climate survey was for Factory Shoals Elementary School. And the purpose of our survey was this. It was designed to collect data from you teachers. 10 teachers were selected. There were 25 questions and they correlated with the seven uh, correlates of effective schools. This data is going to be used to identify strengths and weaknesses in regard to our school climate. There are seven correlates of effective schools. And the seven correlates are instructional leadership, clear and focused mission, safe and orderly environment, climate of high expectations, frequent monitoring of school student progress, positive homeschool relations, and opportunity to learn and student time on task. The first correlate is instructional leadership. The principal is the instructional leader. Principal communicates the school's mission to staff, students, and parents. The principal effectively manages the instructional program. The principal provides a sense of shared purpose and understanding. At Factory Shoals, the data show that our school feels we have a strong leadership. We are provided ample opportunities for additional training, and we feel that the administrators trust our professional judgment. Clear and focused mission. The staff is committed to school goals and priorities. Staff knows assessment procedures and is accountable. Staff accepts responsibility for all students' learning, and staff is all moving in the same direction. At Factory Shoals, there was a little discrepancy in our ideas. Some people were not sure that student success would be determined by the strength of, of instruction, and some wondered if race would not be a factor. This indicates that we need to study this a little further and find out what is really our focus. Safe and orderly environment. A safe and orderly environment is free from harm. The climate is not oppressive. Climate provokes teaching and learning. Here at Factory Shoals, the teachers feel safe. We know that the students do not carry weapons to school. Climate of high expectations. Staff believes that all students can learn. Staff has believed that students will meet standard mastery. Adults in the school expect students to succeed. At Factory Shoals, there was again a discrepancy because not all teachers believe students will succeed in college. I believe that this merits further discussion and study. Frequent monitoring of student progress. <clears throat> student progress is measured frequently. The progress is measured frequently so that teachers can adjust their instruction. Assessment results are used to improve stu student behavior and the curriculum. At Factory Shoals, Teachers provide support in class, and they believe in student success. They especially believe that students can achieve on test. Teachers use these test results to monitor progress. Positive homeschool relations. The school communicates with parents and caregivers. Parents know and support the school's mission. Parents play an active role in the school's mission, and parents are partners. At Factory Shoals, the teachers believe that par parents primarily do support the school's activities and the school. At Factory Shoals, parents and teachers know one another, and teachers all agree that they respect the students. Opportunity to learn and student time on task. Instructional time is maximized. There are limited interruptions to the school day. 
Time is given to the essential curriculum and students are engaged in teacher-directed learning activities. At Factory Shoals, teachers work to foster support all the student learning and give them ample opportunities. Teachers believe that we are preparing our students to be productive citizens. Conclusions. What are we doing well at Factory Shoals? What are we effective at? Teachers feel supported by the principal and we feel that there are adequate opportunities for professional development. Teachers feel safe at school and agree that students do not carry weapons. Teachers believe students can achieve on assessments and they, that they do provide support by progress monitoring. Teachers believe that they are fostering a learning, learning climate for all students. Conclusions, what do we need to examine or what do we need to work on? Is our mission and focus clear? One question we need to ask ourselves, is student success really determined by the strength of instruction? Or, as some folks have indicated, is race an additional factor? And if this is true, what can we do about this? Do we all have high expectations? Some teachers are really not sure that, teacher, that, excuse me, that the students will succeed in college. How can we all get on the same page? And I'd like to ask you, does anyone here want to share anything or in the results that they would be interested in or do they have anything they want to add to the conclusions? If not, I want to thank you for coming today. I thank you for participating in my survey, and I hope you all have a wonderful Sunday.